Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. My name is Lyndon Bilal. I'm the commander of the Muslim American Veterans Association National. First, I'd like to commend and give thanks to the mosque cares, Imam W.D. Muhammad II, and all the other leaders, organizers, and presenters that have worked so hard and diligently to make this 33rd annual Muslim convention possible. Also, we'd like to congratulate all those worthy individuals selected to be recipients of annual awards last night, as well as those who received awards and recognition in the past, and those who will be recognized for their invaluable contributions to building our community life in the future. It was 30 years ago when Imam Muhammad was accompanied by the great humanitarian and boxing legend Muhammad Ali and visited the Pentagon in which I was a host for a uh, luncheon and Imam Muhammad gave a very succinct and dynamic presentation. It was a very, very uh, memorable event at the uh, invocation that Imam Muhammad gave to be the first Muslim to open up the US Senate in prayer was 30 years ago. So I'm just putting it together, 30, 30. We got it there too. And in Imam Muhammad's address, he said he would have voluntarily enlisted in the military. And he mentioned that he loved the discipline and order that the military requires of one to be an excellent soldier. So I enlisted in the Air Force in, on February the 14th, 1980 a few months after I completed high school in Gary, Indiana. And I didn't understand or have much sense of what it meant to be patriotic and the true responsibility on me to be a US citizen. And I didn't really begin to understand that until I embraced Al Islam under the leadership of Imam W.D. Muhammad in 1981. So I was blessed and fortunate to have Imam Muhammad's leadership which enabled me to make positive changes in my life daily. And it protected me. I want everyone to know that this year represents the 25th anniversary of Marvel's founding. So I encourage all imams and community leaders to encourage the younger generation and everyone go to our website, marvanational.org. I want to also encourage all the presenters who did not register for the mosque cares convention, but you presenting, and I'm not only speaking about those on this program, I'm speaking about any program, that you should register for this program. It was an excellent program, three-day program. And it's not just about this event here, but it's about our whole life and our generations to come.